Amy and Alon, first of all, I want to say congratulations on the Impact Media Award. Um, for us, it's very special. It's very special to have you guys here and to be honoring All American Muslim. Um, and the first thing I want to talk about, which I'm sure many people want to know, is how the idea came about of putting All American Muslim on the air, of making it and then actually airing it. Um, it is such an honor, by the way. We're thrilled to be here. Um, but I. You know, the idea came about internally. There, we we have quite a history on TLC of going into subcultures in the U.S. and really kind of getting into communities that people might not know very much about, mm -hmm. and and opening that up and letting people experience what life is like with these families, and and you know we had we have quite a track record doing that. Some of those families have become some of the most beloved families on television, and and when this idea sparked internally, it, it just took off. We knew, we knew it was a, um, a community that we were very interested in and had a lot of curiosity about and we felt our audience would as well. Mm -hmm. Alone, I, from a production side, I just want to talk about, you know, okay, now that the idea was there, making it happen, you know, choosing the right people, choosing the right ideas for it. Yeah, well, it, it certainly was a long journey. Um, we, uh, you know, about probably about a year before we started production, we were actively looking for families, and we looked in, in a lot of different cities. Uh, ultimately, we did fall in love with these five families in Dearborn for a lot of reasons. Number one, they were we just felt that they were great personalities. We did like the idea that they knew each other and that they would intersect sort of in an organic way. And also, we, we were somewhat intrigued by Dearborn as a community and sort of making that a character in and of itself uh, with such a large Muslim population. Uh, that said, when you do have five families and that many characters, there are inherent storytelling challenges that, that always come up with an mm -hmm. ensemble cast like that, particularly with uh, five families. Mm -hmm. So uh, that was always our, our biggest challenge, I'd say, from the get-go, is we had so, so many rich stories to tell and so many characters to cover. You have 43 minutes of television time. Mm -hmm. So I think from square one, that was something that we were very focused on and always trying to sort of work through the, the, the devil in the details of telling mm -hmm. all of those great tales about these Dearborn folks. Mm -hmm. You know, in, in, in my mind, it seemed always, you know, from, from the moment I first found out about it, that Dearborn was the most logical choice, that it was in and of itself a character in this show, because it is such a phenomenon in the U.S. What are you kind of, your feelings about, about the, the snowball kind of that, that came out of all of that? Well, I mean, I think to us, it was uh, a pretty remarkable experience. Um, the groundswell of, of support and the media attention that this got, you know, before we before it even started airing. I mean, I I would say that it is probably the most well-reviewed show in the history of mm -hmm. TLC, which we were all so honored by and kind of blown away by. Mm -hmm. And then once the show start to, started to air, yeah, there was a lot of discussion, but there was also a lot of incredible support from people Absolutely. in the community. Uh, coming out from uh, all over the country and you mm -hmm. know our, our uh, Facebook and website and uh, just hearing from people talking about how much they appreciated the show and how much they liked the show mm -hmm. it was really uh, sort of a pretty pretty cool time for us mm -hmm. I mean yeah TLC shows are, are no strangers to to a lot of media attention but I think that this you know in my experience and, and watching it and being a part of it there was just so much, so much genuine, you know, support and, and interest, and, and there was so much going on that I think that it really, you know, I think it had an effect long beyond the life of the show or the life of almost any show. I mean, that's just my personal opinion. But um, in any case, I mean, I, you know, once it, as you were you were talking about the reviews it's gotten, and and um, I just want to kind of get your thoughts on getting an, an award like the Impact Media Awards and, and feeling that a Muslim advocacy organization really recognized the show as something that they would like to honor. I just want to talk about your feelings on that. We were, we were tremendously honored to, you know, get, get the award. I think that what we were, one of the things that was most important to us was to tell the story authentically and, and present present these families' lives in a way that uh, that allowed our audience to, to really feel what they went through um, 
and and decide for themselves how, how they felt about you know Muslims in America and mm -hmm. and I really think that this this award affirms that we d we did what we set out to do which was to show a slice of American life. Absolutely, Alon. I want to get your thoughts on that too no, as someone I who's mean, very I hands agree. on in it. I agree. It's I mean when you're getting an award like this from an organization that is actually on the ground in the communities you know doing this kind of work it's it's even sweeter mm -hmm. to a certain extent you know um, the the support that we got from organizations within the Muslim community from people around Dearborn was incredible and it really does sort of come full circle to, to get an award like this from from uh, the MPAC uh, just because this is this is kind of uh, as as was told to us earlier today, sort of like the Muslim Oscars. So, <laughs> yes, uh, <laughs> yes that's, that's what we like to think of it as, yeah. <laughs> We're feeling very good about that. Well, that's great, and, and I'm really happy to have you guys both here, and uh, thank you for coming, and congratulations on the award, and I look forward to seeing more and more amazing TLC shows really taking us into so many different communities that not that many people hear about. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.